On to our top story now, also in Scott County, a teen is dead and her parents injured in a wreck. Deputies say around 7.30 this morning on I-64, 13-year-old Emily Sams and her parents were driving to Louisville for a volleyball tournament when another driver hit them. WKYT's Hillary Thornton is talking to drivers who saw the crash. She has our top story at 6. Around 7.30 this morning, investigators say two people in this blue car were headed to Louisville from Baltimore, while the Sam's family from Bourbon County was also traveling to Louisville for their daughter's volleyball tournament. We believe that the car was probably in the left lane and the truck was probably in the right lane. At some point, they made contact, which pushed them to the right, as you see, and, and down the hill. Sheriff Tony Hampton says based on preliminary findings through reconstruction, they believe that contact happened when the car went off to the left, then overcorrected hitting the side of the pickup, causing it to flip at least one time, ejecting 13-year-old Emily Sams, who died at the scene, critically injuring her mother, Shella, and also injuring the young girl's father, Jeff. What a tragedy, you know, it's a, we hate to see this. The investigation backing up interstate traffic for miles, but as word about this situation made its way down the line. I understand there's a fatality, a horrible situation. So that kind of, I mean, puts it in perspective. Makes you pause and realize how fragile life is. You can be here one minute and go on the next. I mean, I've got my 14-year-old son with me, and, and I understood it was a 13-year-old girl that, that lost her life, and that, that kind of brings it close to home. In Scott County, Hillary Thornton, WKYT. The Scott County Sheriff says emergency crews treated the two people traveling from Baltimore. They're expected to recover. The sheriff is still trying to determine if Sam's was wearing a seatbelt and if he'll file any charges against the other driver.